top 10 games of the decade. Pete Dore. You start saying different games are good. And then, like, some games that people don't like are bad. That's how you start a huge drama. Oh, yeah. I spent about 11 hours going through every game uh, released between 2010 and 2019. A lot of your favorite games that you think should be on this list are definitely not going to be on this list, okay? Just a warning. Uh, there they are better some choices be. on here that are going to be kind of shocking. better have all my favorite stuff on here. Oh, yeah. No, if they if he puts one game on here that I don't like, and if he doesn't put my top ten, I will freak out. I will freak out and start screaming and start a huge okay. drama with this man. This okay. is this is all right so far. You know he could have got in big trouble. This is a this is an okay pick. You know this is a, this is the game that I think has Wreck It Ralph in it. I really believe that this is sort of the the pinnacle of kart racers. And yes, there were sequels that followed, such as. Uh, this guy should really play, uh, should check out Mario Kart. Wait, this is the one with no record, Ralph? No, this guy, this just started a huge drama. He picks the stupid-ass one that doesn't even have record, Ralph as a character or football manager? No, that's how you, that's, that's, no, that's where you fuck up, actually. No, 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 don't tell me to calm down. This is, this is bullshit. This is a bullshit list. And in my opinion, many of the tracks featured in this game um, rival oh, yeah. and exceed the best Mario Kart tracks in the history. Of Tareba, oh, yeah. Crane Game. What the fuck is that? That's not a game. That's a phone app. I'm about to lose my mind, you guys. Before you're like, that's not a video game. So let me let me break down what this game is. That's what I said. This is listed under games in the App Store, so it is a mobile game, and it is also on Nintendo Switch. Now, what it is? <laughs> he had to actually debate whether or not it, it was a game. Um, you <laughs> control an Come interface on now. through a video, like a game. Don't be putting it on there if we got a debate if it's a game. A webcam that is a live feed of hundreds of real life crane games. Oh, it's this thing. Intent. You're remotely controlling these crane games and trying to win prizes in real time. And if you win them, they ship them to your home. That's not a game. A here, That's a like a computer program that game. they made. There are That's not a video hundreds game. by thousands of people that struggle oh, to get yeah. off of Tereba. So this is actually a real warning. If you have a gambling addiction, heed my warning and do not download Tereba. All right, I'm coming in angry. at number eight. Uh, Nino Kuni. Now, All right, Kuni that's a game. That's a, actually like a video a game. game for me. When I first heard We're getting into better territory um, here. Skip ahead. Also says a lot about me. And, and oh, there you go. That's actually a real game. How my uh, game of 2010. What oh, the yeah. fuck? What did he just do? What did he do? For he put Uncharted on there just so he could put this in there. For a Look what he did. All right, this is going to start a big ass oh, drama. Good old Final Fantasy 13. I know this what one's going to anger a lot of people. Who are like, how dare you put Final Fantasy 13 on your top 10 games of the decade? Look, I love Final Fantasy 13. It's his favorite game of 2010. Um, I love 13. I've actually grown to appreciate it more over the years now that I've like kind of invested time into learning the speedrun for this oh, game. Yeah. This isn't like guilty pleasure games. This is his top 10 games of the decade. This isn't just like bad games that I like anyway oh, yeah. this is the top 10 best games if you're not aware the combat system in this game is actually extremely complicated and intricate um, but you wouldn't really know that unless you really delved in oh, drama Mondays is such a <laughs> drama Mondays is such a sad day Babe, can you fix my Jake Paul poster? I think he said Final Fantasy 13 and like the po the poster was like drawn from the evil energy. Oh yeah. I'll make sure that doesn't get ripped. That's my most valued possession. This has been up on the wall five oh, days. I look up at it every day and it inspires me to make great stuff that I make now. <laughs> Why are you oh, laughing? Yeah. This poster is kind of like the Final Fantasy 13 of posters. All right, we're good. We're good to go. Into it and looked into it outside of just the game's tutorials and even the strategy oh, guide. Yeah. The speedrun strategy. Is it falling already? What the heck? Stay. Jake Paul oh, pisses yeah. me off sometimes, man. All right, number five. This one um, may shock. Better be something good. Number five better be something good or I'm oh, about to... Yeah. I'm about to rip my Jake Paul poster off the wall and scream. Huh? What are you going to do with the poster? Nothing. You're going to rip the poster off 
post it for long? No, no, no. I just taped it up for you. That's my most prized possession. I use my special tape. Yeah. Alright. Ah, that's the wife. Fuck some people. But I had to include it. That is Hearthstone. Now I know I've played, played Hearthstone in a few years, but this game was such an important part of my life from the past previous decade that I just I couldn't not include this. This is all right. Hearthstone. That's a multiplayer game. You know, you. That's one of those games where you end up playing it more than you think you will. That that would be like a good entry for like number ten. This kind of goes in line with the Final Fantasy 13, I guess. He likes making little RPG combos and stuff. Skyrim? That game's not good. How'd he put that? Journey. There you go. What the f- Wait, what the fuck just happened? What the fuck just happened? Hours I've invested into this game, I, I said, I can't... I can't put this out. Don't do it. I know what game he's gonna put on there, but don't do it. Change the video somehow. Is Smite. Um, but Smite, I played Smite. Don't, Smite first. Don't tell me about Smite. It don't you ever tell me about nah, Smite. It's gotta be Last Guardians. What the fuck? Oh, yeah. Where are you going? Don't worry, guys. Don't worry. I'm gonna go. I'll go find him. I'll go calm him down. I'll go calm him down. Don't worry, anyone. I'll go find him. Oh, yeah. Guys, I can only take so much. You can only do so much messed up stuff to the dunk before I get, before I walk. He put the Last Guardian as his number one game for the decade. He's got a little Last Guardian little doggy next to him. He actually bought a plush of that dog, that fucker dog that doesn't even walk. The shittiest AI I've ever seen. That fucker dog that all he does is he fucks you over. He bought a plush of that dog. That's his favorite game. He put Smite. He put a crane game that's not even a video game. He put Final Fantasy 13. He put the Sonic Racing game with no Wreck-It Ralph. If I had that little Last Guardian little dog, I would oh, chuck yeah. him like fucking Logan Paul does. Yes, there's Trico, which is sort of a, a big wrench thrown into the game, but he's sort of like an evolved version of Yorda. That Trico is an asshole. He just kills you and he doesn't listen. The census is it absolutely lived up to the hype and the weight. No, it didn't. Oh, yeah. That shit took like 14 years to come out. This is a huge drama between me and him. This sickens me. It really sickens me to see. But this this is a great guy, everybody. Uh, don't start any drama with this. This is a great guy. He just really likes these weird games that I don't approve of. But this is a pretty funny guy. But there is going to be a huge drama with him. And if I, if I see him out in public... I'm gonna fight him in, in a video game.